Jesus, Jesus, speaking about himself, said in John 3.19, the light has come into the world. That's what he said in John 3.19. The light has come into the world. But now when Jesus left this earth as a man, after his resurrection, death and resurrection, his light stayed. How? In us, through us. We are now the light in the earth. We have and are the light because Jesus gave who he is To us. Have I lost anybody yet? So now the only thing we have to do is shine. Come on, look at somebody and say, it's time to shine. Come on, say, how bright is your light? Come on, everybody say, Jesus be known. So our mission, our mission as Christians and as a church body is to use the light that we have been given to shine it on Christ and make him known in the earth. I heard somebody say, it's just real simple. It really, we need to shine the light of Christ. Um, so, so how do we make Jesus known with our light? That's, that's the question. How do we make Jesus known with our light? How do we shine our light? It says, let your light shine. Think the King James says, let your light so shine. How do we let our light shine? Oh, this is going to be so good. How do we let our light shine so that Jesus can be known? The answer is right there in front of us in Matthew 5, 16. It says... Let your light shine before men in such a way that they may what? See what? See how you praise God? See how you preach? See how you tell somebody they're going to hell? So they may see your what? Come on, everybody say good works. And through that glorify your Father who is in heaven. Shine your light. Here's another way to shine your light. Shine the light that God has given you. Use your light to shine it on good works, to do good works. Shine your light. Shine your light. Let your light shine before men in such a way that they may see. Well, what are you shining it on? Your good works. 